Finally, some fun. Yo, Broloff can solo this. <sighs> we might get some gold here, ladies and gentlemen. Send two gold our way, see what happens. All right, if you guys do take the time to drop a fatty thumbs up, I appreciate you. All right, the algorithm needs us right now. All units. What is that from? If you know what it's from, you're a real gamer, okay? All units. Or, or if you know what this is from. Job's done. <laughs> okay. Real freaking gamer. Are we buying everything or not? I think we are. <sighs> yep. Yep. I did, did. Did we buy that? I think we did. I think. Yep. Maybe. I don't know. Anyways. Um. <sighs> nah. 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 <laughs> this is a champion. I'm dying to play. <clears throat> All right. Digging the pen to kill. I think we're going to pre-level. I know we're going to pre-level. And I want to show you guys what the heck this is all about. All right. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Pre-level looking good. So we've been dabbling. Okay. When a unit dies, nearest ally gains 25% max health shield and 10% stacking attack. Your headliner. Oh. Heals for the super fans for 20% of your damage dealt. Your headliner damage heals your super fans. For, oh my goodness. Wait, this sounds real nice. Gain adaptive help. No, 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 no. We're going super healing, super fan shenanigans, dude. Look at this gnar. Don't freaking mess with us. We got to find one more. One more super fan to get on in there to do his thing. All right. We're going to have these guys pop off. Nar is our next champion in our A through Z that I am trying to show off for you guys. Which champion are you most excited to see? Let's see. Next up, we're going to be cooking. Who do we have here? Uh, we're currently on Nar. Oh, Graggy Ice. He's actually insane of a tank, dude. That guy is slick with it. <clears throat> All right. As for Nar items, I like... The AP, HP shenanigans, okay. Not sure if we're going to be busting out AP NAR, okay. I don't think that's going to be happening. This BT is amazing. And it might be time to sell this Olaf just because we got to start fishing for our boy, okay. Especially at level 5, we're going to have to sell this dude. Maybe we can get a win streak early though. Oh, we'll see. Coming on through, baby boo. Okay, this guy doesn't have uh, his true damage shenanigans proc'd yet with the items and all that. So, we should be chilling. I hope. Alright. A level 2 Olaf can carry you a very long way. Which, oh, we love that. We love that. Alright, let's buy this guy. Probably gonna be selling this guy. Ah, we want to hit Econ so badly, but we cannot do it, my friends. Maybe we'll go Mosher. <clears throat> ah, I want to pre-level real bad, real, real bad. But I don't think we're going to be doing it, my friends. <sighs> Pentakill's too good. We got to keep it in there. Screw it. You know what? No, we're not going to do it. <laughs> we're not going to do it. I was going to say we could double level up. And rock it out of the park. But I honestly think we're going to get the Wub Dub anyways. <clears throat> All right. Do not mess with the Olaflin. These guys have too much HP. What are you going to do about it? What are you going to do? Wait, hold up. And he's a monster. But so are we. All right. Heck yes. All right. Heck yes. I'm trying to think. What is the next off-meta crazy champion we're going to be highlighting, all right? Who is a champion that is impossible to make the star of the show pop off? You know what I'm saying? Or get me out of here, mate. Get me on out of here. We don't diddly lost a nah, mate. Um, let's think. Screw it. Can't go wrong with some tankiness, but we might actually want to save this. For something else. Dude, the wind streak. The wind streak, man. The wind streak. 
Screw it. If we lose, we still have good econ. Maybe we'll greed for the next one. I don't know. We'll see. Ba -da -da -da, ba -da 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 -da. This might be where we meet our match. Jinx is uh, a little terrifying. What even is her mega? Headliner effect. Minigun attacks grant one extra attack speed. Rocket launcher attacks deal an extra 10% bonus AD. That's pretty good. Ay ay ay. It's a two star rat. Who the heck allowed that guy? Yikes. Well, hey, you know what? <clears throat> we got our econ. We can sell our boy. And keep the 30. The same bat. Okay. The same bat. The real question is, are we going to want to go Mosher for some super healing or not? We got to see what this does. Your headliner damage heals your super fans for 22% of the damage dealt. So, we want extreme high damage on this guy. Okay? And we got to make him our headliner. So, he can go absolutely nuts. What item are we going to get? From our shenanigans. Is it going to be another BT or what? Is this guy just going to have the craziest amount of super healing we've ever seen before? Ay ay ay. There's so many different options that we could get if we do get a chosen Nar. That this is going to be a little, uh, a little crazy if you ask me. We're not buying the Tom. We're probably going to be selling him here in a second. There we go. There we go. There we go. We still want to find Chosen Nar. We'll probably ding that at level 6 for now. We're kind of just chilling. Kind of just chilling. Titans Resolve would be nice. I'm trying to think what else would we actually care about. Last Whispers I. Blue buff. Who the heck is getting that thing? I don't know, my prince. I don't know. We're going to figure it out, okay? But... If we don't hit a NAR soon, we're going to be in a lot of trouble. Okay. I'm talking a lot of trouble because we're not going to be able to hit our chosen with so many out of the bag. You know what I'm saying? Ay, ay, ay. And the fact that we want to wait till six till we start actually rolling gets me a little spooked. Say less, Mosher. Time it is, baby. Oh. <laughs> We're going to put in a whole bunch of these dudes. A whole bunch of them. We're going to have Omni Vamp shenanigans for days, okay? First of all, we got to find a cannon. First and foremost. I'm actually down to keep the Mosher in our... Even though I was looking a little forward to some kind of super fan shenanigans, but screw it. We don't need the radiant item after all. All right. The amount of Omni Vamp this guy is going to have is going to be not okay. Headliner effect at the start of combat transform into Mega Nar. This is actually bad with Titan's Resolve because Titan's scales up the AP that he gets, then he jumps, then he gets even more HP. So maybe. Titans is something we want to stay away from this time around. You know what I'm saying? Game one random component and two random tier three champions. <sighs> oh, excess healing. Yo, say less. Say freaking less. We're getting all the healing we can find, baby. And uh, I guess we're chilling with these guys. <sighs> Bing bong. Here we go. Ay, ay, ay. Low key, we gotta combine these Nars somewhat sooner, or else this is gonna be a a little difficult. I really hope this Nar can carry, man. The amount of Omni Vamp he's gonna have is definitely gonna crack us up. Okay, I'm very excited to see what the heck that looks like, especially with the 70% attack speed he's gonna be getting once we flush these suckers on out. Okay. I definitely want to get the jacks back. This guy's probably not going to find a spot in our team comp. I guess we can focus on the pentakill for now. Why, hello there. Four months, my doll. I'm doing pretty good. How are you? Four months, Pog. How you doing, buns? Um, yep. Things are going pretty freaking juicy. I'm not going to lie. Oh, my God, dude. 
screw it. We're just going to level and put him in. He's a strong boy, all right? We want him. We like him. Let's do this. No, but for real, things are going well, all right? Love and TFT. Earth is out. The A through Z series over there is going spectacular. And uh, it's a good time. It's a good time. I just want to see how crazy on the Omnivamp side of things we can go with this guy. Okay? Because it is going to get wild. Not only do we have this and this, but six Mosher and items. Bro. At what point is the Razzle Dazzle a little, a little too much? Maybe since we have so much Omnivamp, getting some kind of thing that'll make us tankier could be worth it. I don't know what the heck we want, man. Uh, I guess Sterix to make sure we never die could be solid. Oh, man. Oh, man. Last Whispers, all right. It's a tough one. It really is. Buy a bunch of tier twos and see if we can get lucky. Oh man. We're gonna buy this Olaf, even though we're probably not gonna get him. Okay. We do like this. More Mosher, less Pentacryl. Wait. Hold up. Okay, we could have ran Pentakill and just took another this guy, but. It's all groovy. It's all groovy. <clears throat> I'm down to get rid of these guys if we have to. Okay, which we shall. All we need is two more Gnar boys. And we'll be good to go. Okay. 70 mana. I was going to say blue buff could be cool, but nah. Not his cup of tea, my friend. Not his cup of tea. Two more. Come on, Nar, buddy. They're killing us right now. Whoops. That's not who we wanted. I think I'm down for that. If we win, we're getting 50. One problem. I don't think we're winning. Maybe we can level up Olaf after all, though. Okay, this is cool. Bruiser, Pentakill, Mosher, gotta love it all. Okay. Yo. Your boy. Yorick. It's in this so well. If we can knock it out of the park, that would be sick. Alright. The part that I'm worried about is getting this super fan to fit well in this team comp. Okay. That's where things are not going to fly that well. Oh my god. What? The hard part is Emo is not going to fit well here either, bro. Is this for real for real? <laughs> yeah, if we can get the 0% York, that would be the dream. Hello. Hello. Is this for real? We love the Mosher. Here comes the Gnar. Don't even sweat it. Okay, this is good. Huh. We don't need Mr. Karthus. Come on, baby. Really? Okay. Okay, you know what? Okay. Okay. It's gonna be like that. Let's see what the super fan thing can do for us. I'm considering dropping Olaf. Ay ay ay. There's a lot of considerations going down right now and I don't like it, okay? We're going to have to make some kind of items. 
We have some good stuff to go along with it. Let's see, blacksmith gloves, no. Okay, you know what, I do like the long rounds. Let's go ahead and do this. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Sterex. I love that. We're two Nars away, that's the real problem. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hmm. If these guys if these guys don't combine, ooh, we're screwed. All right. Not trying to be a negative Nancy over here, but oh, we're screwed. Yikes. Okay, we have good champions. There are some tier ones we do want to lock down. I'm trying to think. It looks like... Vi is no longer going to be with us. The poppy's cool. And our team comp's going to be all over the place with super fan. In a pretty darn good way. Okay. Guard breaker is decent, but it doesn't it doesn't wake us up in the morning. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't get our juices flowing. Okay, those were good items. Bro. The things we would do to just get this gnar now. So we can not have two of the same shenanigans in the same You see what I'm, are you picking up what I'm putting down right now? Okay, good. Oh boy, we might need to find another damage dealer too. That's the scary part. I wonder if some kind of crit will be good to go. Oh my gosh. Okay, you know what? Let's, this says your team 10% Omni Vamp and converts 20% of excess healing into true damage on their next attack. Okay. With how much excess healing we are legitimately going to have. We will be able to create so much healing with this intact. That we're going to make you lose your mind. All right. This BT is going to be going elsewhere. We're on to something here, fellas. No one has ever created an R like this one. But my God. This NAR is going to rock your freaking socks off. Dude, speaking of NAR, can we just get the NAR? Double Nico as much as I wanted to do that. We also don't want to do that. Are we doing the four super fan? I guess we don't necessarily need that boy anymore. Huh. <clears throat> this game is wild, dude. I want to focus on the excess healing that we actually have. And I want to see how nuts it can go. Oh my god, he crits for a lot. Dude. <gasps> a lot. And he heals his team a whole lot. <laughs> He's actually a super medic, dude. Oh my god, we're 33 HP. What? When did that happen? Screw it. One reroll. I was feeling lucky. Okay. Yep. Not what we wanted. <laughs> Bro. How are we going to do this? S set is going to be amazing. And. Ay, ay, ay. It's our super fans that we mainly care about. We like leveling these guys up a lot. We don't need this guy. 
three-star Olaf, dude. It's gonna happen, okay? Probably not, but maybe. And the free Poppy. I'm kind of down. The fact that we just have two Poppies right now is weird, okay? It's weird. Okay, hold up. How did Nard die? What happened there? Review the footage. Oh, yeah, yeah. We just gotta three-star this guy now. Or else we are gonna have a serious, serious problem. 18 HP. Okay. Okay. Yep. Yep. 70% attack damage. Yo, that makes his... No wonder he's hitting for so freaking much. That makes things real nice. But not nice enough. Let's see. Lily is leveled up. We're good there. Knocking out Kennen would be sick. Oh, boy. Uh, we're going to have to figure out something with this guy. Let's go with you. Got the gnar. Bada bing. Wait for it. Bada boo. Okay. We're in the money, ladies and gentlemen. We're in the shmoney. Let's see what this champion can do. All right. Oh my god, no. What the heck? Bro, it popped off his item. No. We liked his sterics on him, not the BT. I thought it would... Mm. Oh, that's convenient. <laughs> Very nice. That's for our boy. And we're freaking in this, fellas. Okay. We are in this to win this. And Poppy is going to do us so proud. Poppy will be the main squeeze carry for a little bit, but not a lot of bit. That's going on you. And I don't know if we want the Last Whisper Titans. Screw it. Last Whisper it is. We're going for big damage. Big damage is what you shall receive. Okay. I don't think Sona fits in that well, especially without any items. So we're kind of chilling. Dude, this Nard is starting to pop off. Big, big time. 9,000 healing. Just wait till we put more moshers in the building, baby. We're making a comeback. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Is there a KDA champion we want to find? Is there a KDA champion we are looking for? Dude, I love this guy. Feel free to damage him. See what happens. <laughs> oh, God. He's under attack. Dude, he just bonks back to full HP every time. Bonk. Bonus damage equals more healing. Bonk. <laughs> Bonk. Oh my god. I'm obsessed. He just healed for 2,000, dude. 16,000 healing. What the... Huh. Those were a little hard to choose. The spatula items really sucked. Getting anti-heal would have been nice. Maybe a little Karthi Karth in the back. Action could have been cool, but you know what? We got to start shooting to get our boy. Okay. For Mosher, even more healing has entered the building. All right, this is where things really get crazy, okay? This is where six Mosher is gonna be from your boy York, and that'll allow us to get rid of one pen to kill, which probably will be Olaf. Bruh. Are you guys picking up what I'm putting down right now? Oh my gosh, wait, we gotta give this away. 
That's for you, big guy. Sure, sure, sure. Probably should have given the support or the tanky items to super fans because those are the ones that are getting crazy healing done. This guy doesn't die, bro. Look at him. <laughs> 10,000 healing from your boy. We're going to be selling Olaf. Screw it. We're going big on the econ from our boy. I mainly just want the attack speed off this, okay? That would be our dream. Speak of the two monsters that we're going to be snagging. Is it Urgot or not? Some range would be nice, don't get me wrong. But if we do go mega late game, Zack attack would fit in oh so well. I say we hold on to this. Okay, this looks good. I actually love the build that we came up with. My god. <laughs> if we ended up getting... I guess a Radiant item would have been too much crazier. Look at him go, baby. Look at him go. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. The Sterics makes him not die so freaking well. Okay, like I said, we're going to need a lot of gold as long as we don't get 18 damage bopped. Everything should be okay. Holy God, level 10 is going to be so greedy. I feel like it's a bad idea. Okay. I feel like it's a very bad idea. At this point, I'm thinking... Uh, I mean... We can still hit 6 Mosher and 3 Penta. We just got to hit York at 9. I wanted to greed for the Zack and make sure we guaranteed got it, but no, 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 no. Too much gold, not gonna happen. Let's not be that greedy, okay? We can be greedy, but not that greedy. You know what I'm saying? Speak of the devil, this will be groovy. This Mordekaiser monster. Actual beast. We don't actually get that much stronger from Ding in level 9. We mainly get stronger once we find Yorick. Okay. That's how we get strong, strong. So until then, we don't really need to get our hopes up that much, if I'm being honest. Moshers equal Yorick. And I think it's going to be... I think we're on Team Urgot, fellas. The Jax is cool if we go level 10, but we are not going to be going level 10. Oh, no. No, no, no. Don't lethal us. Do not lethal us. We need to kill one more unit, please. No! How much HP did that... How much HP did that guy have? Dude, how... How... Little... I guarantee you that stupid chain vest on my freaking bench would have made the difference on that jinx. Oh my god, dude. No. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I am so sad. We're going to go cry now. Bye-bye.